Welcome back to another YouTube video. Thanks for tuning in. We have the Logitech for Creators Blue Yeti USB microphone. And I will actually be using this same microphone to make this video so y'all can hear how it sounds. I have done my own settings and stuff like that in the uh, Blue Voice app. And yeah, so this is just gonna give you an idea of what kind of sound quality you can get out of the Blue Yeti microphone. But let's get into the unboxing. All right, so at the time that I purchased this microphone, it was on sale on Amazon for $99. Average price you might find is $130. And I believe that's the standard price without any markdowns. Good value, I've gone through maybe three mics in total. Um, and so far this one has had the best result. First thing you see, that is the USB connector and it goes on the bottom of your mic and connects to your PC. Few items with this mic. Um, so it is a condenser microphone and it has three capsules that can capture your voice or sounds, um, whether that be like podcasts, streaming, gaming, Zoom meetings, multiple use microphone. Um, it comes with the Blue Soft Blue Voice software and it is a standalone app that you download and you can modify your voice, how it sounds. You can make the EQ settings different, uh, a host of different items. Um, so we got a quick start guide. It shows you how to talk and put your voice. And now we are pulling off the styrofoam piece that is protecting the actual microphone. And there is that midnight blue. It was tightly packaged, really good. Getting you a close up. Even the microphone is wrapped in plastic as it sits in the styrofoam. I actually had some trouble trying to get it out of the styrofoam. It was very well packed in there. I'm sure it didn't move, bounce, or anything while it was being stored. And lifting up the styrofoam piece, there is nothing else in the box. So we are going to just put our trash away and move this aside. All right, pulling the microphone out of the plastic. And that blue is just so stunning when it hits the light. The video does not do it justice. It's like a matte sparkle and like the finish when you touch it. Uh, the buttons are uh, very high quality buttons. See at the bottom, there's like uh, some rubber padding. If you wanna use the stock base, um, on one side you have the blue logo. You got the mute button, you got your volume button, which controls the volume you hear in the headset. And then on the bottom here is where you will see, it's kind of blurry, but there's the USB connector. There's the headphone jack so you can listen as you speak. And then if you wanna use a separate stand or a boom arm like I'm using, you can twist it into the bottom of the microphone. All right, so on this side of the microphone, you have the pattern knob, the gain knob on top, which would affect how loud and sensitive your microphone is, picking up your voice, background sounds, all that good stuff. The pattern knob changes how the microphone captures. So inside the microphone at the top, it has the three different uh, capture areas and you can make it omnidirectional, unidirectional, you know, if you're shooting a podcast or versus doing a stream, recording a video, you only want your voice, uh, four different settings for there. On this back side, you have the volume knob and you have the mute button, which when it's unmuted, it'll be a solid red button. When it's muted, it will be a flashing red. And the side knobs actually adjust how secure the microphone is in the stock stand. If you wanna take the mic out of the stock stand, you just keep loosening those sides. You saw how loose it was and just fell over. Keep on loosening that until it lets go of the microphone and it just pulls out and the knobs actually stay inside the case or inside the stock stand. 
And here's a closer up of the USB that connects to the bottom of the microphone. And this is a plug and play mic. The USB is pretty long. Um, for my setup, I did have to use an extension uh, to the USB though from, because my computer's on my right side all the way, but my boom arm is all the way on the left of me. Um, but yeah, just plug and play. Your computer instantly recognizes it. You can go ahead and start using it right away, however you want to. Uh, just select it as your audio uh, input device. And then you can download Logitech G Hub and you'll be able to access the Blue Voice, automatically detects the mic, and you'll be able to make all those adjustments that I mentioned earlier in the video. Uh, standard USB A connection, and that's really all we have in the box here. Very quick setup, very quick unboxing. Thank you for all the likes, support, comments, uh, subscriptions, interactions, I love it all. And thank you for watching this video and I will catch y'all in the next one.